Jurgen Klopp has promised Liverpool will produce a positive reaction to European disappointment when they face Crystal Palace in the Premier League this weekend. Hello fans, let's go to the news from Liverpool. If you want to stay up to date with everything that happens in the Reds, subscribe to the channel and leave your like on this video. The Reds suffered a 3-0 defeat to Atlanta in the first leg of their Europa League quarterfinal at Anfield on Thursday, their first home defeat in over a year, they do, however, have the chance to respond quickly when they host the Eagles on Merseyside on Sunday as the title race resumes, speaking after the clash with Atlanta. Klopp was asked how he can ensure that the disappointment of that result is not carried over into the next game. First of all, I can't guarantee that, I never could, the chief told reporters. But it's still the work I have to do, I don't think it's a low point in general, even when you can also look at it that way, it was a low point in terms of performance. The good thing about a really bad performance is that it's easy to play better. So we must start from there. First of all, tonight is supposed to be bad, and it is. I told the boys, take them home, no one will sleep well and tomorrow we will be together. The boys who started recover and everyone else does a proper session and you go from there. And then on Saturday we will start preparing for Palace, yes, we have to show a reaction. Definitely, 100%, that's clear. But I can't plan the reaction 20 minutes after the game. I'll think about it. Unfortunately, this is not the first time in my life that I have lost a football game and yes, we will show a reaction, I can promise. One positive aspect of Thursday's game was the return of Diogo Hoda, whose appearance as a second-half substitute was his first since suffering a knee injury in February. Trent Alexander-Arnold was also part of the Red squad, but Klopp says he will need to be more careful with the vice-captain, who has also been sidelined since February, also with a knee problem. There was no chance to play Trent against Atlanta, said Klopp. He was on the bench because we were able to put 23 players in the squad, he had two sessions. Diogo was no longer there, but the information from the medical department is that he was one step ahead, so he can play a little longer. There's no pressure to protect returning players from injuries, it's just the situation, my job now is not the easiest in the world, nor the hardest either, but it is when you have players that you need to make sure that they are together on the field and that everything works out somehow. In different lineups we played very good football this year, but today we didn't, so that's the reason we lost, that might be the bit didn't work a headline, so that's all fine and dandy, but we need them all and we need them all aggressive, in shape, going for it, a little angry, full of desire, things like that, and not so much dealing with their own situation, like, I don't have any rhythm, it's been a long time. That I don't play, things like that. And you, fan, in your opinion, will Liverpool be able to reverse the score from the first game? Comment below, leave your like, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any news from the Reds.